Hey, uh, uh, McDouble, McDouble. What's up with the little blurred ketchup there? Who, who thought that was cute? It's bothering me. Get rid of it. Andy, please get rid of it. You have mental Illinois. I diagnose you with Chicago. And I'm about to make all the citizens of Chicago so angry. <sighs> Illinois. Why is it thinking thoughts that upset it? I don't know, little weird cat. I just don't know. If I wanted to reach my new low point, I could make Tumblr posts and read them for a video. But who would be so silly as to take a post someone else made and read them for content? Could be worse. Could it be the person intentionally writing things to bait said post reading? You know. Just say. I don't need new shoes. I need new feet. Because the ones I currently have start hurting after two minutes of walking. I hate it. One time I dreamt there was an official crossover between Ultra Kill and the Mandela catalog. It was a dating simulator. My god. Shout out to anthropomorphic snakes in animated movies doing poses that would normally require arms or creatively using their coils as arms instead. Gotta be one of my favorite genders. This is what it's all about. Hey, emojis can't do this. Behold, March Simpson. <clears throat> Shout out to the time my mom was hammered and I heard her trying to tell my dad that she murdered her first husband years ago and my dad very patiently said, I saw Glenn in an elevator last week. Good job, dad. I want so badly to become someone's blobo. Imagine being the little guy in someone's head that they spin at terrifying speeds. Why not me? You want my advice? Log off Tumblr and make yourself a nice grilled cheese. Using good crusty bread with half cheddar and half Parmesan cheese. The best possible soup for dipping it into is Campbell's tomato soup. The kind that comes in a little can that you mix with water. Only instead, he use milk. God, Tag, you're not family-friendly content. You know your anxiety is a problem when you get very stressed about asking someone to clarify the first answer because you didn't understand it the first time. If anyone needs me, I'll be in the glue trap. I won't be. If anyone needs cough loop, just cover the earth in glue traps except for one spot. Terrible Pokemon evolution method ideas. A Pokemon whose evolution depends on the status condition it has when it levels up. A Pokemon that only evolve if you have more than one million Poke Dollars. A Pokemon that evolves after getting frustrated that you keep faking playing catch with it in Pokemon Camp. A Pokemon that only evolve if it hates every Pokemon in your party. A Pokemon whose evolution depends on the clothes your character is wearing at that moment. A Pokemon that only evolve if there's a Pokemon who has a type advantage to it in your party. A Pokemon that evolves if you catch it in a Premier Ball. A Pokemon whose evolution depends on the number of badges you have. Ooh. A Pokemon that only evolve if one of your other Pokemon has the same nature plus a move as it has. A Pokemon whose evolution depends on if you gave it a cute nickname or a scary nickname. A Pokemon that only evolve if you keep it in your box long enough, then put it in your party at least one week. A Pokemon that only evolve when there's at least two fainted Pokemon in your party. And finally... A Pokemon whose evolution depends on where you caught it and where you were when you hatched its egg. Are you just trying to, like, destroy Game Freak's code here? It's already a giant pile of spaghetti. What are you trying to do? Add some more meatballs into it? Do you think Icarus would be into wax play or would that be a safe word zone because of trauma? You don't get quality content like this on other sites. Everybody likes going down. Stop! You know a character has really hit their gender out of the park when they're popularly headcanoned as trans mask and trans femme. I know I'm about to target a very specific audience here, but I have seen it. I am looking directly at you, Genshin Impact Twitter, and your Al Haytham content. Good job. Every time my boyfriend says, for the time being, I respond with, for the time being. And then we say, all hail the time being. And carry on the conversation like nothing happened. Ah, nature's healing. I say, donning my hazardous suit to roam the bomb-torn wastelands as I see a 12-inch cockroach skitter across the camera. Every day, my soul is crushed by emails, and every time I kiss, I swear I can fly. Can't you hear my heart beat fast as per my email from the past? Need you by my side. -na 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 -na. One time I dreamt the Muppets were doing an adaptation of The Legend of Zelda and Miss Piggy was mad she had to play Ganon. But it works so well. Plus, on top of that, you get memes of Ganon going, Din you ever get no sleep and the next day your body functions like the Tumblr app? Me, we need to study. Brain. 
I'm sorry, whoops, juicy, we made a big old... Is everyone reblogging this okay? God put me on this world and said, let this dumbass roam. We are all God's Roombas that he let loose. Some of us he gave knives. I haven't used my iPod in several years, but since my phone broke, I'm using it for music. Got it hooked up to my Bluetooth speaker, which politely says, Battery high. Connected to Lars' iPhone. Generally. So I really wasn't thinking about it and absolutely wasn't expecting it to say, Battery high. Connected to a disgusting little man. Because I had forgotten what I named my iPod and it quite literally bowled me completely over. I hate Shark Slander. They're literally just sitting there in their own living room. He doesn't know what the fuck's going on, just leave him be. Big shout out to Baked Potatoes. Well, thank you. I got high and thought this was directed at me and that Baked Potatoes was my new nickname. I'm, I'm sorry. Writing prompt. A medical robot in a long space flight has tried everything. Makeshift defibrillators, CPR, injecting adrenaline, but it's no use. The crew have died. As a last ditch effort, the robot downloads all information on necromancy. Aw, oh, that's a sheep, baby. A motherfucking sheep!